everyone, I just wanted to start off with saying if you watched my last video and I'm wearing the same clothes and have the same hair and makeup, it is because it's the same day and I'm just doing some bulk filming. So that's why I've got the same stuff on. The dog's just nicked one of my leaflets. Get off! That's not yours. Today's video is another social network solutions hamper. I feel like I've been ridiculously spoiled by social network solutions recently because I've had so many hampers from them. I've been getting these hampers for a while now and every single time I am never disappointed but this one, I feel like I say this every single hamper that I get, this one I absolutely love everything that is in here. So let me find my leaflet. If you've not seen my social network solutions video before, um, basically they are a company that helps brands get in touch with bloggers and bloggers in touch with brands and if you've watched these videos before you'll be sick of hearing me saying that because I say it at the start of every video um, but yeah every so often I get a hamper from social network solutions with all these different goodies inside from different brands and this one I feel like they've just excelled themselves anyway this month's theme is hair and beauty I mean can it get any better than that because hair and beauty is what I'm all about so on the back it says we hope you like it we hope you like it and enjoy showcasing some amazing brands. All gifts have come complete with a direct link and some even have exclusive promotional codes for your followers. So if I do mention a code, I will leave it down here just so you can you know what I'm actually saying and you know what code to use on the website. Anything that I have shown in the video, it will all be linked down below as well. So let's start. So this month's hamper again is in one of these wooden boxes and again this is something I say in every video it comes all cellophane up with a, with a big pretty bow wrapped around it but I can never help myself and I just have to dive straight in to see what's inside the hampers. The first thing I pulled out of the box is this Lee Stafford Argan Oil from Morocco hair dryer. Blow dry faster and nourish a professional 2200 watt AC dryer. So basically I've got a Lee Stafford hair dryer. My hair dryer that I use at the minute, I have a Mark Hill one and I am obsessed with it because it's one of those that doesn't cut out. So I like a good branded hair dryer. I know Lee Stafford is a good brand. I've used, you know, plenty of his products before. So this is an argan oil infused hair dryer, which is very interesting. It says it generates negative ions for a superb, soft, shiny finish. It has two speed and three heat settings. But then again, if you do put most hair dryers on the hottest setting, that's when it starts turning off and it's really annoying. And there's a three meter power cable. So I have been dying to use this hair dryer, but obviously for video purposes, this has all just been sat in the box. In fact, I've been dying to use everything. So let's take it out finally and see the hair dryer. So it's in this plastic as they always are. So let's just open that and take it out it's such a nice colour look at that it's so shiny and new I haven't had a hair dryer in the longest time and yeah I feel like I'm going to absolutely love using this I can't believe I've put a hair dryer in here how good is that so yeah like it's just your normal hair dryer with a cord I don't think there's any attachments oh no there is I'm going to say because my hair dryer now I use one of these like little thingy my bobbies on the end obviously I've not got hair extensions in at the minute so my hair doesn't take too long to dry but I find once this little nozzle thing is attached if it does attach am I putting this on right um I always feel like this dries your hair quicker if you can actually get it on because it's not very quick trying to bloody get it on is it Okay, so I'll figure out putting that on in my own time because now I'm just wasting time in the video. And it does say on the side, Lee Stafford Argan Oil from Morocco. So thank you for that. That's amazing. I actually have two more things from Lee Stafford. Like, can you believe this? So first thing I have is Curl Your Heart Out Cone Wand. Again, I have needed a new curling wand for the longest time. I'm going to say the exact same things again because I've had a Mark Hill curling wand for the longest time and it's like just my holy grail and it died on me and I was like oh my god what am I going to do without the don't even sell it anymore it's been discontinued so anyway let's have a look what this one is like because I am intrigued so let's take it out of the box this is my type of curling wand I like the shape of it that it's quite thick at the at one end and then it turns dog please stop snoring and then it turns thinner so you get like more of a 
bigger sort of curl at the top and then it goes into a tighter curl. You also get a little glove. I never actually use these gloves, so I just end up burning my hands instead. Um, but yeah, this actually feels like an exfoliating glove. It doesn't feel like one of those usual curling gloves. The back of here, it says worldwide voltage, use it anywhere. Ceramic coating, create an anti-frizz free finish. 13 to 25 millimeter barrel for a glamorous drop curl effect. Heats up to 210 degrees and gets hot in no time. Heat protection glove to protect your fingers. Like I said, I never protect my fingers with the heat protection gloves. So you guessed it, another Lee Stafford curling wand. This is the Curl and Nourish curling wand. So on the back of here it says, Tourmaline, Tourmaline ceramic barrel infused with argan oil to leave hair nourished soft and shiny. So this is the same as the hair dryer, like with the argan oil Morocco thingy. Includes a heat protective glove to protect your hands and fingers. 3 meter power cable, salon, salon length for ease of use. Now it also says it's a 33 millimeter barrel for big, bouncy, beautiful curls. I don't actually have a curl like this where it's a lot thicker. Like I said, I use usually like the one that I've just shown beforehand where it's thicker at one edge and then it gets thinner. So let's have a look at this one. So this is what this one looks like. As you can see, the sort of wand on this is just the same thickness and length throughout and it is a lot thicker than the other one so this is going to give you bigger sort of wavy curls rather than tight curls so yeah I'm dying to use this and see what it will feel like on the actual hair. Thank you so much for those. The next thing I'm pulling out is Harvey and Coco Smile Rehab Teeth Whitening Kit. So here we have a little kit. Let's open up inside. The packaging as well, I don't know if you can see on camera but the actual writing's in like a copper rose gold colour and it looks really nice against the white so I do like the packaging and it opens up like this so we have a little leaflet and it says teeth are always in fashion and basically you've just got a little like guide which shows you how to use the teeth whitening kit so it's one of these kits where it has like a mouth guard and a LED light and then we have two non peroxide teeth whitening gels which are five millilitres each so if I just bring that in closer so you can actually have a look at the kit close up. So reading the instructions you put the gel into the mouth guard and then you put the mouth guard in your mouth for 20 minutes and you apply pressure by biting and after you take it out you rinse your mouth your mouth out with water so I love a good teeth whitening kit like I've used so many in the past so Hopefully this will be a good one. There's a few bits in here from this brand that says I love and this is a Violet Dream scented bath salts. So these are those like little salts that you put in your bath. I absolutely love these in the winter. I mean I don't particularly have baths in the summer just because it's so warm uh, but I definitely always use these in my bath at winter. Violet Dreams. I want to guess these smell like Parma Violets which I absolutely love. Oh, I actually just sound here what they smell like. So it says bergamot, green apple, palma violets and rose. I want to see if I could smell it through the bag but you can't. But they sound amazing anyway. I also have a shower gel from I Love and this is called Vanilla Milk or oh, it's called Body Wash. Key notes are bergamot, vanilla, milk, accord and amber. So let's have a smell of this. I love body washes. I am so sad. I just love shower gels and different scents so that smells insane. Oh my god, that's going straight in my shower. I love anything like vanilla scented, so that is going straight in my shower. And then last up I have, I love glazed raspberry body mist. Key notes are raspberry, strawberry donut and vanilla strawberry donut. Oh my god. So this is what the spritz looks like. I like to put these in my bag for work because sometimes you feel a little bit smelly when you're working. And they're just, and they're just easy to just spritz all over yourself, aren't they? So let's have a spray of that. That smells amazing. Did anyone used to use those natural collection, um, I think it was natural collection sprays from Boots. This is exactly what it smells like. Apparently it lasts up to four hours as well. God, really, she knows I'm not picking bogies by the way. Apparently the smell lasts up to four hours and it is non-sticky. So let's see if that lives up to its name of lasting for four hours. I have three things from the brand Tabitha James Cran. Never ever heard of this brand before. But I do have a 15% discount code if you do want to use it. 
and it's this one here so try tjk15 that will be here by the way don't expect me to think you'll all remember that these are hair care products and says welcome to the future of hair care on the back it does have like a little list of products and it says love your hair love your planet clean ingredients ethical and sustainable guardians of natural hair so i'm guessing it's just like all natural products first thing i have is a shampoo so this is the clean amber rose shampoo scented with organic essential oils of rose patchouli and ylang ylang enriched with organic extracts of rosemary horsehair and marigold so this is a good size shampoo as well it says no synthetics 100 natural not just L sls free and paraben free no synthetic ingredients and a truly 100 natural preservative system so there's a new shampoo to go in my shower it smells like something and i can't think what i feel like i have a perfume that smells like that but i can't think what it is but anyway it does smell good then we have a dry shampoo compact organic dry shampoo fair hair so does that mean like for blonde hair i'm hoping so anyway because imagine me getting sent like a dark hair dry shampoo that wouldn't be a good look how nice is this packaging well this is a nicer dry shampoo this is probably the nicest dry shampoo i've ever had so yeah this is definitely for fair hair because i can see down here that it's got like a blondie color it says it's 100% natural ingredients, 90% certified organic. And let's have a look what it says on the back. Shake well before use, spray into your hair generously, massage lightly into the roots. So yeah, it's just a dry shampoo basically. Let's have, oh look at this, this is, oh, this is posh. Right, okay. I've just washed my hair but just wanted a sniff don't actually smell of anything but I absolutely love the packaging of that and that's going to fit perfectly in your handbag the last item looks really interesting with how it's packaged I've never seen one of these little things little fishnet things before anyway this is an organic four-in-one conditioner amber rose nourish, nourish style and revive so this is not tested on animals 90% certified organic suitable for vegans and you can recycle it as a traditional conditioner, apply to wet hair and comb through, leaving for 2 to 10 minutes. As a leave-in conditioner, apply one pump to the mid lengths and uh, I can never read. As a scalp moisturiser for dry, flaky scalp, apply topically where needed. As a styling aid, start with a small amount and layer as required. So basically this is a conditioner and a leave-in conditioner, a scalp moisturiser and a styling aid. What more can you want from a conditioner? Although I feel like because I have so much hair that this, I'll probably use this in one go. I've just noticed some more bits from Harvey and Coco, which were the teeth whitening kit. So they also do vitamins. I have a root rehab hair vitamin, which for me at the minute is brilliant because I am actually using some hair vitamins. And because I've got no extensions in basically, I'm just trying to get my hair in better condition. These ones you take two capsules a day, drinking two litres of water daily. A sophisticated blend of 14 essential nutrients including marine collagen, biotin, vitamin D3 and cel selenium <laughs> to support a normal hair growth cycle and maintain healthy hair. You get 60 capsules in this one and then again 60 capsules in this one. This is a complexion rehab so this one is for your skin. As we age skin collagen levels decrease leaving your skin looking tired, saggy and wrinkled. Got a blocked nose. Complexion Rehab provides 700 milligrams of premium collagen each day, plus 60 milligrams of vitamin C, which contributes to the normal formation of collagen. And again, you take two capsules, but these ones are before bedtime. So yeah, I will definitely use these. I love a good supplement. I actually am using some different skin ones as well at the minute so i'm using skin and hair so once they run out i'll definitely be using both of them i've been bloody rubbish with this box because i found something else from the brand i love so this is an elderflower fizz scented body butter keynotes are elderflower jasmine apple and cucumber this is huge by the way so let's have a good sniff that smells amazing you can definitely smell the cucumber in that and cucumber is one of my favorite foods so oh, i love that there's a little card from, is it Primalash or Primalash? 
I always say Prima, but maybe it's Prima. I'm, I don't know. Anyway, I've followed these on Instagram for the longest time, but I've actually never used their eyelashes. So I'm really happy to get some of their eyelashes in this box. So these ones are in the style Margarita. And can we just like appreciate these eyelashes? How thick and fluffy are they? They're going to look amazing on a night out. They're definitely not daytime lashes, but I absolutely love those. And there will be lashes that I get use out of. And um, we also have a different style, and these are in a different packaging. And these are in the style Allure. So let's have a look at those ones. These ones are a lot more wispy and a lot more day to day wearable. They are in different packaging because these ones are mink hair. Usually, I'm not a mink person to be honest. I would never go out of my way to buy mink eyelashes. Um, but nevertheless, they are very pretty eyelashes and these ones are velvet lashes so these ones are 100% vegan so we have two different sets of eyelashes full brush holder and obviously inside there's going to be some makeup brushes I don't actually know where these are from because it doesn't I don't think I've got a leaflet for these ones but anyway let's have a look at them because I've not even taken them out of the packaging yet so these are like Let's pull one out. I'm going to pull this one out because it looks interesting shape. Okay. I do actually think it's got the brand on it. So let's take the little netting off. I love this brush. They're so soft. So these are Elizabeth Farrer brushes. And they've got like a gold sort of handle. But then this bit is like a darker gold. And this is where the branding is. This brush is amazing. I actually don't think I own a brush that looks like this. Obviously it's like a stippling, buffing sort of brush. But I haven't got one that that is this like fine like not fine because it's not fine but small this small so we've got a few different face brushes and different eye brushes as well i just love new makeup brushes especially eye brushes i get a lot of use out of eye brushes um i always tend to stick with the same face brushes for a while throw them away and then move on to new ones so i do have a little pot of brushes where they're all new and they're never being used so they can go in my new brush pot this tiny little tin in here with like a little cross on it it looks like a button it says get the best from your balm so exo balm is again sacrificing product efficiency for any reason efficient efficiency i don't know what that means anyway so if it is a little cold your balm may firm up in if this is the case use the scoop to take the amount you want and warm it up through the palm of your hands anyway i have a leaflet on this in fact, I've got a discount code on this as well. So, 15% off and the code is DISCOVER15. And it is valid at www.exobam.com. I need to read up on this because I'm not 100% what it is. So, it says, it's a multitasking natural beauty balm. It soothes and nourishes patches of dry skin, cuticles and lips. It's cruelty free and it's fragrance free, making it suitable for those with even sensitive skin. So it's made with coconut oil, olive oil to hydrate the skin and beeswax as well. Okay, so basically it's a multi-use multi balm. Are we going to be able to get in? Can I get in? Because it's bloody... Yeah, on the back it says that it protects skin, hair and nails. So let's have a look. Oh, and there is a little scoop inside as well. So basically this is what it looks like. It's just like a balm. And it's definitely fragrance free, it doesn't really smell of much, but it's going to be good because I get really dry skin on my hands. I don't know if you'll be able to tell, but I've got like peely skin in the palm of my hands and I, I don't know why that happens. It's usually when I've been using a lot of water. So I'll definitely be using that for my hands and see how it goes. Last thing in this box is another box and it says, Olivia, it's here. Great things, you'll love what's inside. So I love a little bit of personalisation. And I do have a big leaflet on this as well. So this is called Revive Serums. So let's have a look at this. I've also got a discount code for this one. 10% off any size order plus free shipping. So use my code Olivia10 at the checkout. So let's open the box. So inside here we have some products wrapped up so let's take these out i'm legit gonna have so much recycling to do so first thing we have revive hair stimulating serum with stem cells peptides and growth factors maximum strength 
What is this? Unique and powerful active ingredients help promote hair growth in both men and women. Ah, I love a hair growth product. The boxes feel nice as well, they feel quite velvety. So in here, it's like a little liquid. I didn't expect it to be in a liquid bottle. And we've also got a pipette, ah, a pipette, pipette sort of thing. So any directions on how we use this? Directions, is it on the back of the bottle? Ah, so apply once daily to wet or dry hair, about one or two drop squeezes or more. Part your hair and apply directly into the scalp, especially in areas that are thinning. The measurement does not need to be exact. Apply enough serum for good coverage, massaging with fingertips, then wash hands well. Decrease frequency or discontinue use if irritation. Ah, so this is a hair serum that we pipette into the scalp. That's interesting. I'd love to know if all this stuff works because I'm all about hair growth. Next thing is a rejuvenating scalp serum mask and pre-shampoo booster. Anti-DHT, stimulating, soothing, purifying, thickening and conditioning. So what does this one do? This one helps back the actions of a 5-alpha reductase 2, don't know what that means, reducing the DHT. It soothes itching, stinging, irritation and fights flaking scalp odours and oiliness. Anti-inflammation and gently exfoliating, it also encourages blood stimulation and a healthy supply of oxygen to the scalp. It increases penetration of actives to the hair follicle. Basically, it helps with like a dry scalp and also it says it strengthens hair and helps fine thin hair to look and feel like naturally full hair. So let's have a look what this one looks like. This one is more like a serum sort of when you just spray on, um, not spray, pump on. Use separate hair into multiple parts, apply directly to the scalp, Using the treatment pump, about six to eight pumps, gently massage of the entire scalp, leave on for 10 to 30 minutes, rinse well. Okay, okay so you put this on before um, you do your shampoo. It also says rinse well and follow with an appropriate shampoo and conditioner. The serum mask can be left on overnight if tolerated. So I wonder if it does feel a little bit funny on your head because it says if you can tolerate it. These are cruelty free as well, by the way. So. The last thing we have is Revive Lash Lash and Brow Stimulating Serum. I can already guess what this one is from reading it. So let's take this out of the box and see what it says. So I'm guessing this is going to be one that helps your lashes and brows grow. If I can get it out of the box. I had to rip the box because I literally could not get in. They all come in with um, little leaflets by the way in the box just to help you know what you're doing. So this says apply a small amount once a day along the upper and lower lash line as if desired throughout each eyebrow. Blot off any excess. So this is going to be it because I have no eyelashes. So it's like on a little, it's more like a makeup brush rather than like a spoolie sort of mascara brush. So I'm definitely going to be trying that out and see what, it's like, what it is like because I'd love for my bottom eyelashes to grow. There's nothing more I'd love because I hate my bottom eyelashes as non-existent. So as always, thank you Social Network Solutions and to all the brands that have kindly donated their items to me. I absolutely love everything and I'm going to get use out of every single item in this box. Like I said, everything that I have shown or mentioned will be linked in the down bar and I will also put the discount codes down there as well. Thank you for watching everyone and I will see you all in my next video. Bye!